Hey guys, Gray here, and today I am doing a review on the Catwoman 1 to 1 scale pistol from 1966. Um, this gun has actually had a lot of updates over the years. There was even a scope at one point uh, uh, um, when two other actresses who played Catwoman had it. The original Catwoman um, back in 1966, she did it with this version. Um, so there was Julia Newmore, Lee, uh, Lee, what was her last name again? Um, Maddie Merweather and Eartha Kitt, if I remember correctly. Um, basically, Catwoman has had many people play her over the years. Uh, but those were the three originals back in 1966. And this is what the gun was based off of. Um, shout out to Catwoman, by the way. She said she liked the 1966 uh, um, prop that I reviewed before. So... I'm doing a shout out to her. Uh, her link will be down below as well as the link to the original seller. And um, please leave comments and questions about this. Um, it was originally a model kit that I bought. Uh, and you had I had to sand and paint it myself. So it took a little bit of time and a little bit of energy. Um, the hole is painted on, by the way. Uh, I tried doing a Dremel into it to make it a little bit deeper. But... Um, it's a little bit narrow. Uh, this is actually a pretty awesome gun. I would, I, I, well, pistol, I can't really, I'm not supposed to say gun technically on YouTube, am I? Uh, there's a whole bunch of things there. Like, there's a lot of people that keep on, but yeah, this is like a great replica, I would say. It's very detailed. It took a little bit of time in sanding. Um, it's completely resin. Uh, I would say it's a very good model. It it, it works. It, its design is flawless. It looks just like the show. Um, I wish there was like an attachment way to put on the scope, but I'm working on that. So like I'm trying to find like the same exact model that they use for that part, so, and find a way to make it detachable on the top. But yeah, uh, this is actually pretty cool. Um, if anyone's looking, like I said, I'll put the link down below, as well as Catwoman's, who left a great comment, as she always does. She's a very lovely person. And, um, yeah, I, like I said, I've collected props over the years. This one, I would give a 9 out of 10, but I had to, like I said, it came in a model kit. So I had to sand, paper, it, and use a Dremel, paint it myself. Originally, it was a uh, white resin, so it was very easy to paint it gold. So, um, yeah, I, I hope you guys... Um, he also goes to comic book conventions. Uh, if I think about it, he's at a comic book convention today. Um, Z Zolocon. Yeah, Zolocon. I, I know he does that every now and again, too, because I, I bought from him in the past with a Green Beetle... Uh, not Green Be Green Hornets gun as well as two others, a Harley Quinn and a Joker, um, which I will also do later on in the future for videos. Um, he this He's really good at what he does for making these uh, model kits. Um, he also sells them, uh, like he actually does it very easy. He has a, uh, an eBay site, and also if you actually go to the convention and meet him there, he'll sell finished models. And he'll sell unfinished models, and they're different prices. And the unfinished models are cheaper, actually. So, uh, if anything, I would totally recommend him. And if you like Catwoman videos and uh, uh, and, and music videos, as well as Gotcha, uh, please visit Catwoman's website uh, on YouTube. It is totally worth it. And like I said, shout out to her. Um, have a lovely day, guys. Bye. And also, like I said, 10 out of 10. Have a nice day.